Hi, I'm Kelly Glennon, a chemist at MoMERS Research Laboratory in Atlanta, Georgia. Today I'm going to be showing you how to measure conductivity using freezer glow at a 1 to 1. So at a 1 to 1 we're expecting a conductivity of 13.96 and there are multiple different types of conductivity meters. Um, I'm going to be using this one today but you might also have one that looks like this. So in general, we're going to take our pre-mixed solution, make sure it's well mixed in order to get a representative sample. And for your conductivity meter, if you're using a stick-like unit like this, you will simply submerge the probe into your solution. And for ours, we will be pouring solution into our sample cell to read. So I've gone ahead and, and inserted solution into my sample cell and I'm going to hit my conductivity button in order to read. And I'm getting a reading of 14.46, which is representative of our solution. So following reading your conductivity, you always want to make sure you rinse your probe or sample cell with water or DI.